Hey guys, Cookie Man 16 here, and today I'm going to do an update of uh, the uh, Cyanogen Mod 9 ROM for the uh, Galaxy Exhibit 4G or Samsung Exhibit 2 4G, as it was previously called. So, since um, the last, like the last, my last video, a lot has changed. So, the camera does work. Everything about the camera does work. Um, the vanishing text isn't as bad. You can just uh, reset the app and it'll go back to normal. Mm, it's, it seems smoother to me. Uh, so let's go into settings real quick. Yeah, it's still 4.04. As you can see, let's see where it is. Yeah, it's the latest version was the September 10th, 2012 unofficial signs and mod version. Uh, let's see what else. Uh, let's see what else have they fixed. Hmm. I haven't really noticed any force closes lately. I think the torch still doesn't work, but there's alternatives in the market. Um, let's see. They've added just like the torch widget, and let's see. I don't know what else is new. Uh, you can now change. I know that on the XDA forms you can change the uh, the if it's GSM or WDCMA. Uh, what you do it's on the form you put in your dial pad. You go to service mode, and you type in uh, it's like four numbers, and it you it just gives you a choice. But the one thing is that you, it, when you reboot it, it uh, it won't stay after you reboot. So if you want to use it, like always and always. You might should probably say as a contact. So, let's see, I guess I'll just. Oh, uh, see, it's got all your basic widgets, calendars. It came with reboot logger. Just tells you when the phone's been rebooted. Torch doesn't work. Like I said, there's probably alternatives. ES file manager. I downloaded Noble Launcher. Um, but everything else, and Apollo Launcher, I guess. So, yeah, um, if you guys have any questions or, or if I'm forgetting something, then, uh, just go ahead and leave a comment in the comments below. Thanks for watching.